So students, let's study about magnetic and non-magnetic materials. Let's walk in Magnus shoes and try out this experiment. Take a walking stick, stick a piece of magnet at its bottom end, walk through playground and see what the stick can attract. Some materials do not get attracted by magnets. So, materials attracted by magnets are known as magnetic materials. Materials that do not attracted by magnet are known as non-magnetic materials. So, magnetic materials examples are iron, nickel, cobalt. So, non-magnetic material examples are paper, glass, wood. Let's see the activity on magnetic and non-magnetic materials. The components required for the activity are copper wire, plastic scale, iron nail, aluminium vessel, cloth, cassette tape, plastic ball and a wood. Finally, a magnet. Here we can see that copper wire is not attracted by the magnet. The plastic scale is not attracted by the magnet. Iron nail is attracted by the magnet. And even the aluminum vessel is not attracted by the magnet. Wherein cloth is not attracted by the magnet. Cassette tape is not attracted by the magnet. Ball is not attracted by the magnet. And even the wood is not attracted by the magnet. The magnetic materials are iron nail, copper wire, cloth, plastic scale, aluminium vessel, wood, plastic ball, cassette tape are non-magnetic materials. We shall study the properties of magnets through some activities. For our first activity, you will need the following materials. A magnet, small pieces of metals like iron, copper, brass and aluminium. Place all the metal pieces on the table. Take the magnet near the metal pieces. What happens? You will observe that some of the metals are attracted to the magnet and some are not. The materials that are attracted by the magnet are called magnetic materials. Iron is a magnetic material. Aluminium, copper and brass are not attracted. They are called non-magnetic materials. Now try yourself. Using the magnet, touch the objects in and around your house and make a list.